Hey everyone, um, today I'm going to be talking about HBO's show Game of Thrones and how it compares to the book. Now personally, I think that this show on HBO is so much better than it is on the in the books um, for a lot of reasons. The actors and actresses that play these characters, they make me fall in love with these characters. Now in the books, in the especially the first two books, I hated Diana's character. Her character was so bad and her storyline I couldn't stand it at all. But in the show, I mean, Amelia Clark is a wonderful actress, and the way that they rewrote it and made her character out to be, I actually quite enjoyed it. And not just because she's hot, but she is anyway. Um, now, Diana's storyline in season two has been getting a lot of hate on Tumblr and all over the internet, as far as I can tell. A lot of people don't like this whole entire, like, dragon kidnapped in Karth. Um, plot that they're doing, but personally I enjoy it. Her storyline was really dry in the books, but now it's actually getting kind of good, especially in book two. In book two, literally nothing happens with her, but now in the show, it's actually really enjoyable. Also, another character I was surprised about this season was Theon Greyjoy. Now, Theon was a complete dick, douchebag, whatever you want to call him, that's what he was. Every single, like, ounce of hate I had for him, like, it's not there in the show. I mean, I still can't stand him, but I kind of feel bad for him also. Like, I didn't realize all of his daddy issues when I was reading the books, but now I'm just like, he, his life really sucks. But, um, moving on. Kit Harrington, Jon Snow, great actor. Um, Kit Harrington's wonderful. I love the um what they're doing at the wall right now and the whole entire thing with Egret, Egret, oh, great actress too. Now another thing I was surprised about is Lord Renly. Like in the books, I didn't really care for Lord Renly, but in the show, I I kind of enjoyed him. I mean, yeah, the whole entire like gay thing with Loras that they didn't really talk about in the uh the books, but I mean they kind of hinted at it, but they didn't really say anything. But in the show, it was just like, right there, then and there. And that scene with him and um, his wife, Marjorie, where um, they can't have sex because he's gay. Like, that, that scene was just, it wasn't supposed to be funny, but I found it hilarious. Um, another good actor, the guy who plays Joffrey. Now, Joffrey's a complete, like, bastard. I mean, he's just a douchebag, everything, more so than Theon is, basically. Um... He's basically like what I hate, but the actor who plays him, he portrays Joffrey's character so well that I'm like, I I actually hate him. But um, moving on anyway. Now the main problem I have the, with the books that I don't have with the show is that the books are way too drawn out. Now in the show, they move the plot forward at a good pace every single episode. Something always happens. In the books, not like something doesn't happen each chapter. It's really boring and kind of tedious to read. Now, even though Martin's a great writer and I enjoy his writing, I enjoy the show a lot more for this reason. Um, that's basically it. Guys, um, you can follow me on Tumblr, Someone Saves Me, S-U-M, one, S-A-V-E-Z, S-U-M, shit, I said that wrong, S-U-M, one, S-A-V-E-Z, M-E, not someone saves some, it's someone saves me. Okay, um, that was basically it.